Hello, everyone. This is Alan from GoThrough, the best virtual tour platform and the best platform for publishing virtual tours to Google Stadia. We have here the Insta360 Flow Pro 2, and we're going to learn how to shoot a 360 image with our phone. No need for a 360 camera, a dedicated 360 camera. For that, we're going to launch the Insta360 app, and we're going to turn on the so Pro 2, and we're going to connect it to the arm. And for shooting a 360 image, we're going to scroll down to panel, and we're going to select on the side the spherical image. And we want to switch from HD to Super HD. Now, this is the, the point where I was confused when I initially got the uh, Flow Pro 2. And because normally you place the phone like this, but for 360 image, you have to place the phone like this, like with the arm on the screen. And it shows you where actually to position the height. Then placing that, and now we're going to start the 360 image by clicking the red button on the left side. And it's going to uh, do a countdown. And now it's starting to shoot it. Now, sometimes if you have a bigger phone, it will struggle to uh, calibrate because um, bigger phones yeah, it is. at least for uh, in my case, I tried multiple phones. I tried, I have a Pixel 6, that's pretty big uh, phone. Um, then I tried the, a new uh, iPhone 12, uh, and this is an I think an uh, iPhone uh, 10 was nice. So uh, this phone, I like this phone. It's it's smaller and it's lighter and it, it, it works pretty well. Now, um, when we are shutting the 360 image, uh, we need to make sure we have a pretty stable uh, tripod because um, actually the Insta360 is using AI to generate the uh, NADAR. And NADAR is the part on the at the bottom of the 360 image. So we're not gonna see actually this tripod in the image. So now let's take out the phone and check the 360 image. Uh, what I've noticed is that in small spaces, we're gonna have a lot of um, bad stitching. Like the wider the space that where we are taking 360 image, the better will be the stitching between these 25 images that the, the arm uh, is taking with the phone. Now, oh, looking around, we're gonna notice uh, in different areas some errors. But I think that is okay. It is not too bad. Yeah. So we have a bit here. It's not too bad. I did play with the, with the um, phone and with the arm and I tried actually reversing the phone in shooting in reverse mode. Um, you might get a bit better results if you do that. Um, I think it's up to everyone to decide what is the best way to shoot, like normal or in reverse. But um, yeah. This is uh, the Insta360 Pro Pro 2 and how to shoot 360 images for real estate, I would say. If you have not subscribed to the GoThrough channel, please subscribe to the GoThrough channel. It uh, helps us uh, growing and creating videos like this. Uh, and happy shooting in 360.